I've realized my belt needs a new hole in it. Let's take a look at a couple of different ways we can do that. This belt is a little bit too small and needs an extra couple of holes across here. The first thing I've done is I've measured how many extra holes I'm going to need. I then take a marker and mark out exactly where I want the new hole to be. In this case, I'm going to use a hole punch. All I really need is an appropriate cutting surface, such as a safety mat, a hole punch, and a small hammer. So what we do is we mark out where we're going to put our new hole. I want it pretty much in the middle, obviously, and as equidistant as I can between the existing holes. I'm using a 4mm punch, I'm using a safety mat, and it's a really very simple process. These little hole punches might cost you $2, if that, from pretty much most craft stores around Australia, and in fact around the world. Very easy to come by, we all have a hammer, and a, uh, a simple cutting surface such as a safety mat nice and easy to get. It's a very simple process and it makes life a lot easier than having to go down to the shops and spend a lot of money. Alrighty guys, thank you so much for watching. Please like, subscribe and share and I'll catch you in my next video. I've realized my belt needs a new hole in it. Let's take a look at a couple of different ways we can do that. This belt is a little bit too small and needs an extra couple of holes across here. Another option that's worth considering is an awl. You can buy these from a lot of hardware stores and craft stores.